Can you imagine a world without cars? Think of it. Without wheels, you couldn't drive to the store or bike to the park. We wouldn't have trains for travel or tractors to harvest food. Airplanes wouldn't be able to get off the ground. Clocks wouldn't be able to tell time. There would be no windmills, no lawnmowers, no wheelchairs, no trucks. The list goes on and on. Although the wheel wasn't the very first human invention, it was the first invention that was not inspired by something that already existed in nature. Humans get 100% of the credit for creating the wheel, which is credited with being one of the most important inventions of all time. The wheel makes work easier and more efficient, especially because it provides the ability to carry and transport things that are too heavy or too big to transport by hand. Before the invention of the wheel, all travel and transport of goods had to be done by walking or by boat. The invention of the wheel changed farming, transportation, trade and warfare and made expansion across large areas possible. The earliest version of the wheel was discovered in Mesopotamia in 3500 BC. The first iteration was actually not used for transportation at all. It was a potter's wheel. Ancient pottery wheels consisted of a round plate that was rotated by an assistant's hand while the potter molded wet clay into a piece of pottery. Potter's wheels are still used today, but they have been improved by the addition of an electric foot pedal that allows the potter to rotate the wheel without the use of an assistant. The Greeks were one of the first people to take the concept of the pottery wheel and adapt it to use on a cart or a chariot to transport people and goods. Recently, archaeologists found a wheel dating back at least 5,000 years in Slovenia, believed to be part of a two-wheeled pushcart. Archaeologists have found extensive evidence of wheels being used in Slovenia that date back to 3000 BC. About 1000 years later, in Egypt, spoked wheels were crafted by taking wooden bars or metal rods and fashioning them around the center of the wheel to an outer rim. The addition of spokes with open air in between made the wheel lighter. This was important because it increased the speed at which the wheels could spin and pull a load. However, wheels weren't just used for transportation and pottery. Humans quickly developed a myriad of ways they could be useful. Scientists have found evidence of water wheels being used as early as 1000 BC in ancient Greece. These water wheels had ledges or buckets attached across the wide rim of the wheel and when placed in a flowing river, the force of the water caused the wheel to spin. The axle was attached to stones that in turn would rotate and grind wheat or other grains into flour. The wheel continued to make life easier for everyone. Now, in the 21st century, we use wheels everywhere. Look around and you will see wheels in use in your home, outside, in stores and on roads. From advanced transportation to exercise equipment to telling time and even in simple chores like cooking, wheels make life easier. Who would have thought that a basic round plate invented to make the job of creating pottery easier would quickly become a necessity in our lives. Imagine a grocery shopping cart with no wheels or a square rolling pin for making pizza dough. This simple machine has truly changed the world.